simple manner because we want to reach out to our heroes with all our simplicity and make all our contributions to them towards our prevailing army. Some of us were born under different rule and others under a free sky. But those skies soon became bloody and terrorism ripped our land of serendipity. Sinhala, Tamil, Muslim, Malay, Burger, we all Sri Lankans suffered. Inhuman terrorists and their supporters who form so-called human chains while using innocent Sri Lankans as human shields to continue to terrorize our people. They, are not, they not only terrorize them back home in Sri Lanka, but continue to do so right here in Toronto. We even had an incident last week where a group of misled and cowardly terrorists entered the consulate by use of force. That is the true face of terrorism which they are terror manufactured, factories manufactured over the years. I take this opportunity to thank the government of Prime Minister Stephen Harper for his courage and determination. He and his government had the courage and the conviction to ban the Tamil Tigers and the WTM. organization in Canada. Let us also thank the members of the Toronto Police Force, the RCMP for their efforts. <laughs> to me and to most of us, they are the unsung heroes who take great pains to maintain law and order and bring people together. And you can all, you know how much trouble they are taking these days. We all know what they are going through. This is the time to reach out and help our Sri Lankan Tamil brothers and sisters who have suffered in the hands of the LTT. Even after coming thousands of miles away from home, we can give them a hand. We can show them the light is at the end of the tunnel. Let us all set petty differences aside and unite against terrorism as our forces continue to liberate innocent Sri Lankan Tamils in the north. I request all of you to help the government of Canada and his security establishment to liberate the innocent Sri Lankan Tamils living in Toronto. Let us also pay tribute to all those democratic Sri Lankan Tamils who continue to battle against LTT terror right here. I know most of you all are here. Thank you, friends, for sending out the love. Thanks for saying out loud, terrorism never Sri Lanka forever. Don't let terrorists and their sympathizers tarnish the image of Sri Lanka. If they tarnish the image of Sri Lanka, we, we all love our parents, we love our mothers, we call, we call it the motherland, so don't let because that's where you're born. Be it Canada or any country, we should not allow anybody to tarnish the image. Stand up to them with honor and courage. This is the time our temples, four wheels, mosque, and all other religious leaders should take the lead. Let us stand united and rally behind them. If you are stuck inside a shell, it's time to get out of your shells. If you are out there doing a part of it for your country, it's time to do more. Don't let terrorists and their supporters bring shame on our country with brutal lies and propaganda. Write, speak, reach out. Don't say or never say you're outnumbered. Remember the poem from Sudha Subhashite, Pin Mother's Putun Seyakla Take the message to Canada and to Canadians. If they don't